Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be showing you how to add an access card into Honeywell's WinPack access control system. If you're new to access control, or you're not familiar with the Honeywell WinPack system, don't worry, we'll walk you through it step by step. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of how to add access cards and how to ensure they work properly with the WinPack system. So let's dive in. Log into the Honeywell WinPack software. Simply double click on the icon and open the program. Once you're logged in, navigate to the cards section from the main menu and select card holder. This will open the card holder window. First, let me show you what happens when you swipe a card on the reader that hasn't been added to the system yet. I'll bring up the hardware setup on the screen and open the event window from the operations menu. So you can see. As you can see, when I swipe the card on the reader, an automatic event is generated indicating that the card was not found. You can see the card number displayed. To add the card, click on the Add button from the card holder window. Once you've clicked on Add, the card holder window will appear. Enter the card holder's first name and last name. You can also enter the card holder's email address, but this is optional. Next, Go to Card from the top menu on the window, and click on Add from the bottom of the window. This will open the card adding window. Here, enter the card number, which we found in the event window, and select the status as active. Then, select the access level. If you want to know how to create an access level, please watch my previous video. The link to the video is provided in the description. If you have a keyboard on the reader, you can access the door using a PIN code. You can set the PIN code for this card holder here. You can select the card holder if you're directly adding the card, but we're attaching the card to the card holder we just created, so there's no need to add another card holder. Once the details are entered, click on OK to return to the card holder window. Here, you'll have other options for biometric enrollment. However, We'll cover those topics in upcoming videos. Click on OK to continue. Once the card holder is added to the software, it will appear on the list. Now, let's test the card again by swiping it on the reader. This time, it's still not accepting the card, and the event log indicates that the card is not found, and the sub account is set to default. To solve this issue, you need to push the data into the panel manually, through initialization. To do this, go to the control map, and right click on the IC. Then select initialization. The panel initialization window will appear. Click on select all, then click on OK. The initialization process will start and it will take a few seconds to complete. Once the initialization is complete, let's test the card again. This time, if you see access granted, it means that the card can be used to access the doors. You can add multiple cards with different card formats into the WinPack access control software. We've already uploaded a video on our channel showing how to configure multiple card formats in Honeywell's WinPack Access Control software. The link to the video is provided in the description. Kindly check it out. Thank you for watching this video on how to add a card holder and a card in Honeywell WinPack Access Control software. We hope that you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you have any questions or comments about the content of this video or would like to request a topic for a future video, please let us know in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on the latest tutorials and product reviews. And be sure to check out our previous videos on related topics. Thank you for your support, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video.